Lenzvid's coverage of IBC 2023 is brought to you by Ulanzi Video Accessories, Small Rig, Small Rig, Big Dreams, Jiyun, Make It Real, and Godox, Embrace Creative Possibilities. Hi, we're at IBC 2023 and we're at the digital photo booth and we're talking to Todd. Hello, Todd. Hey, how you doing? This is our Thanos uh, lineup. It's um, uh, camera stabilization with uh, gimbals or a Steadicam. We have a few smaller ones for like lighter setups. We have the Thanos Pro 2, uh, which had like the spring arm has a max payload of 15 kilograms. And we have the Thanos Pro X, which is the uh, 18 kilogram payload version. These setups are meant for like smaller cameras, like the FX3, smaller mirrorless uh, style cameras. The Thanos Pro X is meant for medium sized cinema cameras like Blackmagic or um, an FX6. Uh, and then our newest one, uh, the Thanos Pro Cine, is a more professional steady cam with a payload of uh, 35 kilograms. And it's meant for like big cinema cameras like the Arri Alexa, the new Alexa 35 that just came out. Um, this Sony F55, Sony Venice. Um, so basically any, anything of the higher professional level of cameras. Yeah, exactly. So Todd, can you run us through the features of the, the new product? Yeah, so this is the new um, sled for the Pro Cine. It's much uh, beefier. Um, it's about 1.8 inches thick. Uh, and the biggest difference between this sled and the other sleds is that this has electronics running up and down the sled. So you have uh, limo connections at different voltage. Um, you have 3G SDI running up and down. And then on the top stage to the bottom stage, you have the same connections. Um, and you have a power button um, on the side. And then here's your main limo connector for connecting to the battery. So you have two V-mount battery plates on here. And then we have a third one that you can attach here. Um, and we also have a regular counterweight um, that you can throw on these rods as well. And you can slide the gimbal up and down. And you have a proper... A monitor bracket for um, your seven inch monitor. Um, you also get this new docking bracket uh, that's padded on the inside so it protects the carbon fiber. This spring arm holds uh, 35 kilograms of payload or of weight um, and you get this new vest um, that has a proper socket block just like a regular Steadicam and you also have this um, new center pad so it's much more comfortable uh, to wear this vest is meant for uh, big people, uh, but it can accommodate for um, pretty much a person of any size. In terms of uh, the weight of the, the system without obviously the camera, the batteries and, and the monitor, do you know how much this uh, weighs with the arm? Approximately, I'd say seven to eight pounds of just the sled. Oh, okay. Um, and then I'd say 12 pounds for the arm. It's a, it's a bit a little heavy of an arm, but... Yeah. Is there a pricing for this already? It's available? Yes, uh, so they're doing a Kickstarter right now to get a heavy discount. You can get your hands on this early at a lower price, but when this uh, officially releases the full price for the full kit, which includes the vest, the arm, the docking bracket, and the sled will be about 5,000 US. Okay. Well, it, it, so it goes a, around with the, the pricing of the, the cameras, obviously. Pretty much, yeah. yeah. And for a beginner Steadicam operator who wants to get into the art of it, this is a great beginner kit at an affordable price. Check out more videos on lensvid.com from IBC 2023.